everyone, if you want to automatically sync folders between machines, keep every file, every permission, every subfolder, and have it just work, then you're going to love this. Today, I'll show you how to use PowerShell and RoboCopy to create a super simple real-time folder replication setup. Here's the setup. We're using VMware Workstation to simulate two Windows servers. We're going to create two folders, and one folder is for source server, and second folder is on destination server. Now here's how it all works behind the scenes. On server 2022, we're running a PowerShell script that loops every five seconds. It executes RoboCopy with these options. We also need to sharing each folders which we have been created and provide enough permission into that folders as well. Users account and machine that will be used to replication the data between the servers. Each run logs to a file with the date and time, so you can monitor sync activity and troubleshoot easily. Now you can test access to the sharing folder we just created from each machine. And we will use this path and passed into the script to the right place for source and destination. We also need to create a logs folder to store all the logs during the script running. Okay, now we are mostly done for RoboCopy configuration. So we can do a test by running the PowerShell script manually to ensure the script is working fine. We can create some folders or files into the source folder, and we will see everything will be synced to destination folder. Boom, now you can see the new folder and file are synced. All right, now let's save the PowerShell script into a safe folder and prepare the last configuration. We will use Windows Task Scheduler to trigger running the script every five seconds and keep it running whenever machine startup.
Input the credential and click OK. And now let's start running the task and let's see if the script working good. To see the actual result, we can create or copy some files into the source folder and see if everything was synced correctly. Yes, you can see there are many files we had passed into the source folders and the sync was working really and really fast.